YouTube, it's Addison here. Welcome back to my channel. So before we get started, if you guys can do me a huge favor, can you please subscribe, turn on the post notifications, and give me a huge thumbs up. And today, I have a special guest, my brother Brendan. Hey. He has his own channel named Brendan's World, and today we are doing Never Have I Ever. I have the little questions on this paper, which I'm not flipping over so you guys can't cheat. And then we have never, and we have I have signs. And Brendan, our special guest, he made these. Um, he's a really good artist, so I would go check out his channel because he does paint shoes, um, if any of you are interested. He also does pranks and other stuff like that. But let's get into never have I ever. So the first question is, have you ever kissed someone? So, I don't know this. Who was yours? yours. Okay, I so somebody. I have, um, so it actually was kind of today, um, so I was walking my boyfriend to the bus, um, before I got in the car with my mom, because she picks me up, and so we were walking, we were holding mom, hands. Mom, did you know about this? Yes, she did. <laughs> and we were holding hands, and I was walking to the bus with him. You know it's funny. This is this was how my first kiss happened too. And we were holding hands, and I was walking him to the bus um, because he wanted me to, and I was like, okay, I'll just come. So we were holding hands, and then we got to the bus, and then he just kissed me on my cheek. That's great. Um, so it's not really like I actually kissed him, kissed uh -huh. him, but first grade I actually did kiss this one like cute boy, which isn't really cute now, okay, um, behind a tree. So that's uh, it. Me on the other hand. Um, I, I can count on numerous hands how many times or how many people I've kissed, but let's move on to the next question now, guys. Okay, let's, let's it says, it. have you ever cheated on a test? I would not have expected you to do that. But. <laughs> so I have, so actually it's been this year, so I didn't really know this question on a science test, and I got it wrong because I looked at this kid's test and I was like, oh, what's this question? Oh, what's this question? So like you have folders right here. So like say these are folders and they're up. And I was like working on mine and then I went, oh, what is this answer? And then I got it wrong and then I was like, I learned my lesson and I was like, why did I even cheat? Because what? like, if, if you cheat, number one, somebody can have it wrong. So just go with your own mind. So that's just my One thing I gotta bring up, I don't know if you guys have been here, but I feel like, I feel like it's happened to everyone who has cheated off of a test. You'll like be looking at somebody's paper and then you look up at the teacher and they're like, they, they see you and so you just play it like so you're stressing. True. So you just, so true. So you just play it off like you're stressing and you're just like, or like oh, you're you like, start like looking around, you know, that happens to me all the time. Or well, like you're zoned out and like you're just like, oh. Not all the time. I'm, I'm a pretty good student, but when I do cheat, it happens. Same. And ever since then, I haven't cheated. Okay, the next question. Have you ever faked? Because number one, if you would fake sick, I lied. And I did in elementary a long. If time. you would fake sick, then you would have to take this medicine, which wouldn't really help, which would make you actually sick. So I don't ever fake sick. Like, so I missed five days of school before because my stomach has been hurting. I'm not gonna say the reason why because we're not gonna get into that. But that's it. So it's his turn. He's looking at our dog because he's the most precious thing on earth. And he does this little umbo voice to him. I know, look say, at him. Say why you right, fake right, sick right. now. Uh, oh, I don't know. I just did. And then I remember I was like, can I play with the Legos at least? Because I was a little kid. And uh, they were like, well, if you're too sick to go to school, then you're too sick to play with Legos. So. <laughs> All right. Okay, so the next question is, have you ever punched somebody at school or like, Throw them something at them, like if you hate them or something. <laughs> okay, so I'll Jeez. go first. So there's this one girl, I'm not gonna say names, but when we were in elementary and fourth grade, she'd always throw like basketballs at my head. So I went through two basketballs, I like chucked them across the playground, and it actually hit her. Both of them hit her. And then she like came out crying to the monitors, and she's like, oh my god, somebody hit me in the head. And I was like, and then like a few days later, and I was like, I'm the one who hit you in the head because you keep being mean to me, so why can't I get you back? So that's 
So that's basically what I did. So now it's his turn. In middle school, when your parents would drop you off before school started, you weren't allowed in. You had to like wait under this like tunnel entrance type thing. And I was talking to one of my friends, and uh, some kid, I don't, I'd never talked to the kid in my life. He just walked up to me, and he just socked me in the back of my head, and I was like pissed at him. <laughs> Oops. I was mad that morning. So I just like turned around, chest punched him, face punched him, and then I kicked him in his shin to like bring him to the ground. And that was that. Then within one class, after I got done with my first class, everyone was like, oh, you beat blah, blah. I'm not going to say his name, but yeah, it was, it was fun. It was fun. I'm not going to lie. I liked it. I didn't end up getting in any trouble, but it was fun. I'm not going to say any names because we don't want our channel I don't, to leave. I don't promote fighting, you know. <laughs> but if you've never done it, it's kind of a cool experience, only if you win. But, and I did win because <laughs> she stopped at bullying. But I don't promote it. I'm not saying to do it. I'm just yeah, saying... Just just if don't you do, do it. you didn't hear from me. Don't hear from my amazing brother. Okay, so the next question is, are you famous on YouTube? Now, this one I'm not going to hold up the sign because I'm not going to say never because it will happen. So, and that says never and I don't want to jinx myself. Um, but no, nope. But he does have like one million subscribers. No, I don't. No, I do but, not. I have a thousand. It's a big difference. Whatever, for he's going to be getting there. So, everybody... Pause this video and go subscribe to his channel. If you do, um, then you're uh, you're amazing. Then you're you're, you're amazing, and he'll give shout outs. Okay. And I do giveaways. So yeah, he gotta... does giveaways on his shoes that he paints. So go check out those videos. Next question is: Are you famous on TikTok? Oh my gosh. This one never. Are you famous on TikTok? Hate TikTok. Twenty. What are you at? You're like 26. Mm -hmm. 26? Why? No, I'm not. Where are you at then? I'm at like 2 million or something. No, I'm mean, not 2 not. million. 200. 200. 200. Yeah, 200. Two, two, that still counts as famous. All right. Because I have more than other people. All right. So why I became like famous, well, famous, I should say, is because um, I just am really good at like lip singing and like, because that's what you do you dance. I'm really good at this one dance. Um, go follow me on my TikTok. It's Addison space L period. And um, there's a picture of me and I'm doing like a kissing emoji with a peace sign. So go follow me. Now this is our last question of to commit day. Come well, tonight as you can see. Come here. What are you doing? Come here. Hold on, I'll go get him. No, no, you gotta see him, guys. Yeah, come here. Come here. Here. He should be. Me he's Give just no. Go up to him. Show him. He's just. Go up to him. Let me show him. Show him. him. Show him. him. He's coming up to me. Show him, God. Oh, watch the light. He's a cute thing. Oh, oh. No. Here's our little baby, Tuffy. Oh, he's just his a little puppy. guy. Mwah. He's just so cute. Uh, and he's a Swedish he puppy. Ever. Yeah. Hi. You need Hi. Yeah. All right. All right. Back to the video. Okay. Tell 
me the next day and she's like so we had like these little charts with like smiley faces and like she would email the teacher and she would she, so she told on me and she's like Addie bring your chart over because I know you stole my pen and give me it back so I broke it on accident and it was just like in this bits and pieces so pretend he's the teacher I just hand it on his desk and then she'd be like why is it broken so that's it for today's video and um please go subscribe to my wonderful little brother little one, older also, brother <laughs> make sure you guys subscribe to her as well she's been following me the whole time but the way yeah that's that's that what else to say about stuff right now. i know you just should be ah! okay well please subscribe turn on the push notifications so you can be a part of baby and my family if this was my channel, I'd try to like put the little mouse coming up and hitting the subscribe button. Woo! But this Woo! is on, Woo! But this is on her phone, so I don't know how to do that on this because it's not as professional. But pretend that's there, you guys. I need you to smash the subscribe button. Yeah! On this. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'm not gonna do your outro. Just finish. Go subscribe to him too, and um, if you subscribe, turn on your post notification bell. I will shout out you guys when you. If I will turn the comments on. But when you subscribe, turn on the post notification bell, comment, I subscribed, like, and turn on my the post notification bell. So I know that you are part of the Baby and I family. Go subscribe to my best brother in the world so you can see more vlogs of him, his shoes, and some more vlogs of me doing some more fun challenges like this one um, with him. So, thanks for watching. Peace out.